my name is Kayla and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Thanks so much for clicking on my video today. Today I am going to be doing a little skincare haul. Originally I was going to film with the Morphe Jeffree Star palette and that's actually what I used for my makeup today. If you'd like a tutorial on how to do this, it's actually really really simple. Just let me know in the comments um, if you'd like to know how to do this look. So I did a skincare shopping spree essentially. It's actually not that large. I got a few things that I really have been wanting to try out. We're going to start with Ulta because that's where I went first. There's a few things that I was looking at on the website that I really wanted. Starting with the brand Truly. So with the brand Truly, there's a few things that I really wanted to try that they were out of stock of because I guess they're very popular. Uh, one thing that I was able to get that I did already start using is the Truly um, Acne Patches. I've only used one so far. But they're little hearts. They also come in stars and leaves and I think other things. I'm not sure. I used this and nothing happened when I used it. So I want to continue using them and see if maybe just that one wasn't working. Also, I left these on my sink and they got wet. So they got all squishy and I'm not sure if they work anymore. Like, that one got all messed up. I hope so, but they're only $10 for 36 and normally the patches that I get are the Peace Out Acne ones, which I actually did get as well. But those ones are a little bit more expensive, but I know they work. So I just wanted to try these out to see if they worked. The next thing I got from Truly is a Heartbreaker Jelly Lip Plumping Mask. It looks like this. It's really pretty. And it smells so minty, like the mintiest gum. And I have not tried, ooh. Make it a mess. Oh, that's gonna make a mess. So this has ceramides, aloe, and vitamin E. They are vegan, clean, high-performing, animal cruelty, and they are harsh chemical free. Super excited to use this and see if it actually plumps. The next thing I got from Truly is the Starface Sleeping Mask. And it's just purple, like a gel purple. It doesn't really smell like anything. It's uh, passion fruit, vitamin C, AHA blend retinol for plumping and resurfacing skin. So I'm hoping that that's going to help my skin a lot. It is a sleeping mask, so it's just something you leave on at night. Kind of like a moisturizer. Super excited to try this out. I really hope these products work for me because they're kind of expensive. So this retails for $18 and this one for $14. I also got this, I think it's a Korean skincare SOS Save Our Skin OK uh, drying pink blemish powder with tea tree oil and witch hazel and I'm hoping this will help dry out some of my acne because I do have acne prone skin. Can't see it because my makeup face is great. Honestly I feel really good about today. So it comes in this little like milk carton kind of thing which I think is so cute and it looks like this. It's like some pink liquid. And this one retails for ten dollars. The next thing I got is the Florence by Mills Better Together Peel Off Mask Duo. So it's two face masks. One is the Mind Blowing Peel Off Lavender, or it's lavender scented. And the other one is Low Keep Calm Peel Off Mask in the Scent Rose. They look like this. Very cute components. Okay, the rose one very much smells like rose. It also looks really sticky. Oh, I already smelled the lavender before I even open it. Wow, super lavender. And they're such pretty color. Oh geez, no, please don't make a mess. They're Oh man, mess. Yeah, I wasn't ready for these to be uh, super messy. But they're such pretty colors. They're like way different than I thought they'd be. So that's those. There's a few other things that I wanted to get from Florence by Mills, like the under eye patches and the skin wipes. Also from Truly, I wanted to get their CBD, is it CBD? Yeah, I think it is the CBD um, moisturizer and cleanser, I think is what I wanted. Like the little kit. That it comes in is probably what I was going to get, but I didn't get a chance to get it. And the last thing I got was the Formula 1006 uh, Clean Getaway Skin Clarifying. I think it's like an acne set. And it comes with the foam cleanser, uh, papaya citrus face mask, the So Totally Clean um, Acne Treatment Toner, and face wipes. And I'm actually really excited to give these a try. Right now I'm using something by Drunk Elephant, so as soon as I finish that, I'm gonna start this set. And because I bought all skincare, Ulta had this deal going on where you receive a free gift. So I got this. 
And it comes with the Belief, the True Cream Aqua Balm Moisturizer, the L'Oreal Paris Pure Clay Detox Brightening Face Mask, the Mario Badescu uh, Rose Water Facial Spray, the Shiseido Treatment Softener Enriched Lotion, I think, the Tula Skincare, the Instant Facial Duo Phase Skin Reviving Treatment Pad, the CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion, and the Dermalogica Skin Recovery SPF 50. So sunscreen or moisturizer or something. And then the last one is La Roche-Posay Tolerian Hydrating Bumper. Not sure how to say that word. But so it comes with a whole bunch of stuff and I actually haven't even opened it, so. Okay. A bunch of stuff, all right, let's pick one randomly. This is the CeraVe Moisturizing Lotion. This is the L'Oreal Pure face mask. All of these are just trial sizes. Oh, they also included a coupon for 30% off a facial. Pretty nice. I don't think I'll be getting one though. This is the Tula face wipe, the Mario Badescu. I have the full size of this, but it's a good spray. La Roche-Posay, the Shiseido. Oh, I thought this was a lotion. I don't know what it is. If anybody knows what the Shiseido treatment softener enriched for normal dry and very dry skin thing is. Let me know what that is. I don't have dry skin, but this is the Belief Aqua Balm. Smells nice, hydrating. And the Dermalogica Skin Recovery Moisturizer. So those are all the things I got from Ulta. This is a pretty good deal for free. I think I didn't tell you guys how much this one was. So this one actually retails for $10, which is like, actually, I think really awesome for this many products. I really don't do a lot of shopping for myself because I don't really have a lot of money like that. So I use coupons and I use points and things like that. And I'm really happy that I got all of these things because it's been a while since I've done that. Now for Sephora. I actually got makeup and skincare in this one. So the first one I'm going to talk about is this First Aid Beauty Bump Eraser Body Scrub. And I'm actually really excited about this. I have tried it, like I got a couple samples of it to see if I would like it. And I think I'm really gonna like it. Super excited to try this. I also, like I was saying about the acne dots before by Truly, I got the Peace Out acne because I know they work even though they're a little bit pricey. So that's a staple of just my normal skincare routine. I also got this Glam Glow The Pore Squad set. I wasn't really going in looking for this kind of thing. I'm not even sure that I'm gonna like it, but it was recommended to me by one of the workers there, so we'll see. I like buying skincare sets to see if I like the things in them because it's a small size and I get to try out a few different products. Now for the free gift that I got for that, I got a Sephora Green Tea Face Mask. It's mattifying and anti-blemish. I like the Sephora face mask, so it's really awesome that I got this as a free gift. And so for the makeup portion, I got the Norvina ABH Mini Pro Palette, uh, the first one, because this one's way more my vibe. Before I had gotten the Volume 2 Palette, which is looks like this, very summery and cute. However, those colors aren't super my vibe, and the Volume 1 is definitely way more my vibe. Yeah, for sure. So I'm actually so excited to try this out. Very pretty. Let me know if you guys want a video going more in depth on any of these products or maybe a video with this, which I might do already. I really want also the one that's like cherries on the front of it because that one's super cute and that one is actually also on sale, but I didn't get it because it's still $20. And then the last makeup product I got is the Huda Pastels Mint. And normally I would've got like the pink or the purple, probably the purple because that's my favorite color. But I already have the neon pink and orange, and I felt like I needed the green because I didn't have the green of that one. This one is so pretty. Oh, I'm so excited. I can do so many cute looks with it. Oh, I'm really excited about this one. I really like Huda eyeshadows. I really like Huda makeup in general. So I also got two free makeup gifts from Sephora. The first one being an Anastasia Dip Brow Gel in the shade Dark Brown, a mini, obviously. <gasps> oh, it's so mini! Oh, that's so cute! I've never tried out this product before, so that's super exciting. And the other thing I got was a cream lip stain. I guess it's kind of like a liquid lipstick. In the shade Rose, I think. Yeah, it looks like this. 
Hmm, that's really pretty. It's this one, not these. That's really pretty, I really like that. So super excited for that as well. Sorry this video was so short. I didn't really have a lot of time to film today. I have stuff going on with the chameleon. I have uh, an eye doctor's appointment because I've been um, trying to get all of my doctor's appointments set up because I finally got insurance uh, this month or my insurance changed this month. I didn't tell you any of the prices for the Sephora stuff. So the bump eraser is $28. The Peace Out Acne is $19 for 20 dots. This normally retails for $6. And this is $49, which is kind of a lot. This one is $29. This one was $20. I also got this new shirt, which is like super cute. I actually, I'm actually in love with tank tops with it. I got this one and then one other one, which I'll probably wear in another video. It's super, super cute. It's like an army green tank top um, crop top. Love it. <laughs> I'm obsessed with tank tops. Pretty much all I wear is tank tops. Unless I'm at work, obviously. Then I'm wearing scrubs or a t-shirt. And I'm still waiting on my cremated package. It is taking a little bit longer than I expected it to. So hopefully within the next couple weeks, I will be doing my cremated collection video. I might also be doing a conspiracy collection video because as soon as my package comes for the cremated, there's one item in there that I was missing from the Shane Dawson, Jeffree Star collaboration. So I'll be doing that as well. If you'd like me to go more in depth on all of these products when I'm using them or my skincare routine that like kind of works, I guess, or maybe my base face makeup routine because that super works. Just let me know in the comments. I love to do all those kinds of things. If anyone has any products they really love for oily, acne-prone skin, let me know in the comments. Anything by any of these brands or even any other brands, as long as they're not really, really expensive. I have tried a lot of products, so hopefully uh, somebody can give me some tips. Thanks so much for watching my video. I really appreciate your support. Go ahead and like the video if you enjoyed and leave a comment down below of Anything I said to comment down below during this video, I usually talk about that a lot or say that a lot. And subscribe if you want to see more videos by me. I usually do uh, makeup videos, Jeffree Star, Huda, Colourpop. I actually haven't done a Colourpop video. I probably should because I have a whole lot of Colourpop cosmetics. And skincare sometimes. I don't talk about skincare all that often, but I'd like to. And ring the bell if you want to be notified when I put out a new video. I usually put videos out on Wednesdays. And I'll see you next Wednesday. Bye.